Hello, everybody. Thank you very much for clicking on. This is a very important announcement. Multiple coronal mass ejections, CMEs, radiation plasma ejected from the sun. Four of them are heading towards Earth as we speak. Four, and this is a very serious situation. You were looking at the Enlil spiral chart. This tells us about CMEs and very large amounts of energy hitting the Earth. And as you can see, we are about to be hit by four CMEs. The last time we had anything of this type of strength or in a forecast was during the Carrington event in the 1800s. For those of you that don't know what the Carrington event was, in August and September of 1859, it emitted a series of intense solar flares and CMEs, just like we're seeing today. A resulting geomagnetic storm set fire to telegraph offices and sparked auroras from Cuba to Hawaii. Recent headlines stoking fears of an internet apocalypse if it repeats. Now, obviously, this was written before we had this AR3664 sunspot that we're dealing with now that is completely blowing off these X-class solar flares back to back to back to back. And now we are going to be dealing with all that energy hitting us basically at once. While watching these satellites, this one you're looking at is the Lasco cam. You can see a halo CME. That means when these eruptions happen, it's covering the entire sun, which means it will be hitting Earth. These are directly facing Earth and hitting our atmosphere at nearly seven to 800 kilometers per second. So you can see in this visual how our magnetic field gets interrupted by this eventually that can lead to strong earthquakes it can lead to cell phone outages as we said fires and communication issues and if strong enough physical effects on the human body this carrington event if this were to happen today and what we're seeing in this situation is a very strong possibility that it can happen at any given time as we said before this would be completely devastating to the entire world simply based on the fact that everything we do now is electric so this is something to very much think about and look into if you don't know much about the sun these are already heading towards us and we're expected these solar storms to begin around tomorrow and the next day and some of these storms could be as high as kp7 that is absolutely insanely strong i'll have updates throughout the day my friends but this is a very big set of news that you want to be learning about if you don't know already all right i appreciate you all stay up to date take care bye bye the carrington event the carrington event is famous because in a august and september of 1859 1859 these are supposed to happen every 50 to 60 years so we are indeed well overdue for such an event. It emitted a series of intense solar flares. The resulting geomatic storms set fire to telegraph offices and sparked auroras from Cuba to Hawaii. The event has since become a touchstone of space weather with recent headlines stalking fears of internet apocalypse if it repeats. Well, it appears it is about to repeat. Once again, we have four. All right, everybody. Welcome back. May we have four, four, one, two, three, four potential X-class coronal mass ejection flares all heading towards Earth at the same time. They will hit sometime between tonight and this weekend. If you are not prepared, if you do not have some water, if you do not have some food put back, if everything shuts down, are you prepared? I hope so. We'll be back. It is a dark world. Do try to be a light. Hit the subscribe, hit the like, hit the share, hit the notification. We will be updating on this. Thank you for watching.